Hi everyone, it's Ev Sketch Your Fashion Drawing Tutorials and in this class we're going to learn how to render silk velvet and as an example I'm going to draw and render this Valentina Fall 2016 dress. So let's get started. I recommend you to watch in a full screen mode. I'm starting V neckline lower than your breast and in the middle of your shoulders I'm finishing it and then I'm drawing these folds just follow me so we keep your right shoulder open and her dress has a bow belt besides that her skirt is a line skirt so we are not going to draw that much folds on it but we're going to show this um, hem of your skirt because velvet is very sensitive to movement and the skirt is quite loose in the lower part. After you finish, outline all the details that we need with a fine line pen. For outline I use 0.1 nib. Now I'm using tan color of pro marker. It's a light brown for your turtleneck. And then I'm using cool gray 3 for the shadows just a little bit because it's quite tight in her sleeves as the base color I'm using tea green so if you don't have this really light green then you just can skip this part and leave the dress uh, white and then just start using dark green as I'm doing right now this color is called holly for pro markers and basically right now I'm leaving some area uncolored and that way I'm showing the reflection of light on these uh, velvet folds and as you can see they look like arcs and columns uh, but on the right side they are more irregular because there we have more light so it looks like these patches but still you see some triangles and lines well now i'm using blender i spread some holly color uh, holly <laughs> green on a solid surface and now i'm using blender as a brush when you work with paints so i'm mixing it with green and making this transition so now we have this gradient between dark area and light area so blend is really important marker and you can find it for any marker brand it's like a water when you work with watercolors so after finishing working with blender take your black marker and color the area between the folds so we make this contrast as you can see i'm not coloring everything with black marker but uh, I colored definitely the sides of the default. We're going to work in the same way with your skirt. I already colored it with tea green. And since your left side, for us it's right side, is lighter, I'm leaving more light uh, area there. So velvet is very smooth, it just flows like water and uh, as a result we're drawing these folds, the top of the folds that we keep light uh, in this shape, like long, like long leaves. And I'm coloring the rest with uh, holly green and uh, then we will work in the same way, just follow me. Now I'm spreading the green on the solid surface. I'm using, you can use blender, I'm just using tea green to, again, to make this transition between light and dark area and just make these, you know, light area a bit less intense because this is velvet, this is not silk, so the reflection of light should not be very intense, not like white. Now I'm using black to color your right side, which has less light. 
and then coloring between the folds. I'm coloring your tights with 10 color of pro marker and using warm gray 4 for the shadows. Using also black pencil. With your white ink pen show some texture on your tights and I'm using the same color for your shoes. With warm gray 4 I'm showing more shadows on her turtleneck and after that we are done with this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to Sketcher channel for more tutorials. Like it on Facebook, follow on Instagram. There are more designs covering velvet, rendering and more tutorials on Sketcher channel. See you next tutorial.